Hey, what's up everybody? Chief here. Thanks for checking out today's video. So in today's video, I'm actually going to start off with my April giveaway. Now, uh, some of you might have seen a video that I released uh, a little while back announcing that I was going to be doing a giveaway throughout the month of April. Well, this is the first video to drop with that giveaway. Now, a couple of quick rules I want to go over with you guys uh, as far as this giveaway is concerned. So let me go ahead and pull up this, uh, <laughs> this uh, screen for you guys. Okay, so how do you qualify for the atomizer giveaway all right so first thing you need to do is drop a like on this video hit subscribe if you haven't already and then somewhere down below drop a comment and in that comment i want you to put the uh, pound sign for us old folks or the hashtag atomizer and then add your player id and platform it's very very important to uh, include the uh, correct player ID and platform to make sure if you are selected you do pick up the uh, prize once it's uh, given out by Pixonic. Okay so the uh, second part of the rules here is uh, I will actually be giving away 50 different atomizers for this video specifically uh, and then I will uh, be selecting the winners randomly at the end of April. Uh, that's why it's very important that you do get your player ID and platform correct and make sure that you include hashtag atomizer in your comment. Uh, I'm going to be using a uh, program that helps me randomly select people and I'm going to be looking for that hashtag. So uh, if you don't have it, unfortunately, you will not be able to win. Uh, but like I said, this is only the first of a couple of, of giveaways I'm going to be doing this month. So make sure that you are subscribed so that you can uh, find out when I do another one. Uh, I do expect to do at least one more uh, video giveaway and then at the end of the month I will be hooking up with Islander from Islander War Robots YouTube channel. I will drop a link to his channel in the uh, description and a pinned comment for you guys to follow. Uh, he too is giving away some atomizers this month so make sure that you do drop over to his channel and uh, subscribe to him so that uh, you can find out what you need to do to win an atomizer from him. But uh, anyway, let me go ahead and uh, drop into my hangar for you guys. Uh, I thought I would go ahead and uh, give you guys a little bit of Admizer gameplay since, hey, that's what I'm giving away, right? Um, it's a, a really solid weapon. Uh, I really enjoy using it. Uh, hopefully you guys will too. And best of luck to all of you that are entering the giveaway. Okay, so here we are. We are on the Battle Wreck account today. Um, I just don't have any atomizers on my personal account, so uh, I am on the Battle Wreck to uh, just show you guys a little bit of uh, atomizer gameplay. So uh, let me go ahead and pull up the uh, hangar that I'm going to be using for you guys here. I've got a uh, Phantom in here uh, just to help with some beacons if I do a beacon mode. Uh, but uh, starting here is where you are going to see the atomizers. I've got some atomizers paired up with some shredders. It is a really, really good pairing um, if you guys have shredders in your hangar or in your inventory and you pick up an atomizer I highly recommend uh, pairing these two together they work out really well but uh, anyway you see here this is the uh, ancient tier running atomizer and shredder and then I've got the uh, Cerberus over here running some atomizer and Viper I haven't actually tried this build specifically yet but I imagine it's actually going to do quite well uh, really looking forward to this one I think it's gonna be a very fun build. Uh, moving over here, I've got a leech running four atomizers. This thing is deadly. Um, that's all I got to say about it. It is a deadly build, trust me. Uh, and then finally, I have a, a Fenrir chilling over here with some flame. And I've got a... I've got an Arthur here. <laughs> Sorry for the uh, pause there. I've got an Arthur here running the uh, rocket weapons. Um, another really deadly build. Okay, so let me go ahead and uh, get into some gameplay. Okay, so starting off, I thought I'd go ahead and jump into some free-for-all here. Couldn't wait to uh, give this guy a try. Looks like I am dropping in at the second position here on the map. So let's go ahead and see what we've got uh, to play with. There we go. Should have him suppressed. He is going to uh, tear me up some here, unfortunately. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, start laying into him now. There we go. Oh, 
ended up getting taken down, unfortunately, but that's all right. I have some more where that came from, so uh, that was just a uh, unlucky starting point, but it happens, you know? Uh, let's see. What else do we got going? All right, looks like everybody's on the other side over here. So let's go after this guy here. What's he in? That's a Leo. I'll go ahead and uh, just uh, let these things cool off a little bit. And as I get closer, I'll go ahead and keep firing. There we go. These things are really good at uh, mid-range. Let's see, where do I want to go? I think I'll come back over here, go after that number two player. Let's see what he's rolling in over here. Oh, another Leo. Must be a, a big Leo fan there. Nice. Alright, so took him out. Got a uh, fat Fenrir back there. And just uh, get a little bit of free damage. Come back into uh, cover over here. And I am running Quantum Radar on here just because the uh, Aljuns do seem to be pretty popular. There we go. Wow, this guy must be running all Leos. That's crazy. You don't really see too many Leos in uh, Champion League. But uh, good on him if it's something that he enjoys. Nice. That guy just got decimated, didn't he? Alright, let's see. Let's go ahead. Quantum Radar. And... Get on over here and finish him off. There we go. This is a very, very powerful build. And it looks like we have a few people that are waiting to drop in here. I believe this is that uh, Fenrir. There we go. Get him to his last stand. Chase after him here and should be able to finish him off pretty quick. There we go. And we'll come right back at him. Alright. And this is why I'm running that uh, quantum radar right here. There we go. I was able to uh, take minimal damage with that engagement. Nearly finished off the uh, Al June. I'll get him right here. Let's see, this guy was sneaking up behind me. Not sure what he's in. Get up here into his shield. There we go. And. Go ahead and push back down the hill here. Really good damage even at maximum range here. Just kind of uh, letting them cool down just a bit so that I can get them finished. There we go. Let's go ahead and just push right at this guy. Point blank. I don't have to worry about the uh, weapons overheating. I'm still going to do plenty of damage. Nice. Somehow still uh, finished him off even though he was way over there. Not sure what happened to uh, all the other opponents though. But, as you can see, this is a uh, crazy build here. There we go. Get behind cover. Come back at him. Yeah. 
and finish them off. What do we got over here? Is that another Fenrir? Maybe. Yes, it is. Go ahead and uh, get rid of his shield. Do some damage. There we go. Go ahead and uh, let these cool off. Got another guy coming at me over here. It's all right. Go ahead and uh, come over here and finish this big guy off. There we go. This guy made a mistake. And he's done. Looks like I might have enough time here to... Okay, he deployed a kid. But I'm uh, not sure what this guy's in over here, so... I don't know how I still have my uh, last stand, to be honest. This might be a little bit tougher, huh? There we go. Busted his shields real quick. There we go. Wow, I can't believe this is still the first leech. Get over to cover here. I do have my uh, QR ready. Let's see if he's going to uh, take off. done. Oop. I need to uh, get down to cover here. Looks like we've got an Al Ming in the air now. No idea what he's got for weapons, so I think these guys are finally going to take me out. Go ahead and uh, get as much damage as I can. Before I get taken down. I'm just going to go ahead and keep shooting. I'm still going to be doing decent damage, um, even at this range, and with my uh, weapons not really doing all that well, uh, mainly because you lose a lot of accuracy, but the uh, like the Ao Ming and other Titans hitboxes are just so large that uh, you are still able to uh, do quite a bit of damage. Let's uh, try and get over here. like he was able to take out uh, that kid. Go ahead and just get right over here. Having him suppressed really helped. There we go. And he's down. Nice. This thing is actually pretty darn deadly. Got one more. I don't know if he's... Uh, going to hide or fight. Let's see what he's got. Let's see what he's got. Let's go ahead and uh, shoot. Scoot back over here. There we go. Suppress him once again. He suppressed me. It's only fair. There we go. Get right up close so that I make sure that I'm hitting him. And he's done. Wow. Nice. Just went right through that invader, didn't I? This, uh, this Cerberus, uh, don't sleep on him when he's uh, maxed out. That's for sure. Quick look at the uh, tape here, see what actually happened, see what happened to uh, all the rest of the uh, opponents. I'm not sure what happened there, but uh, 4.2 million damage. Most of that was with that uh, Atomizer Leech, insane damage. Um, and actually all but, uh, 
three of those kills so 15 kills with just that one leech insane insane for sure but uh yeah um good job for the uh the guys that didn't uh, drop out of the match uh, you guys put up a good fight um and uh, as always it was a blast uh, i think i'm going to go ahead and uh, drop into another match though for you guys just to uh see what we can do Okay, so here we are dropping into another game. This time it is Beacon Rush, and it looks like we are on Springfield. I'm going to start off here with the uh, Phantom, try and pick up a beacon or two, and then uh, try and switch over and get some of that uh, Atomizer gameplay for you guys. So there's one beacon. Come on, buddy. Keep on running. Need to uh, get pushed over here, try and get into that uh, center beacon. Looks like they have uh, at least two people going for it. Nice. Teammate uh, suppressed that guy. And uh, I'm going to try and take out this Raven. There we go. Need to uh, get a reload going here. Go ahead and uh, save my last stand. Ooh, the lockdown sucks. At least I was kind of in some cover, so it wasn't getting hit too badly from uh, the other guys. That guy was in the uh, Cerberus. There we go. All right, so picked up that beacon, but we're losing our home. Uh, not good. Let me go ahead and... Uh, Take this guy out while I have the uh, chance. There we go. And uh, try and help my team pick up the uh, beacon over here. There we go. And he should go down. There we go. Got the uh, third beacon. Nice. And I'm just going to go ahead and uh, go for their home beacon. Hopefully they will actually take me out because I want to uh, get into some of those other robots with the atomizers. Couldn't resist taking this guy. And there we go. Alright, ooh, lost the third beacon. That's not good. I'll go ahead and drop into the uh, Cerberus over here and I'll go push for the, uh, the uh, beacon over here on the uh, farm. Get into his last stand. There we go. right through. There we go. All right. I'm sure he's going to drop in. Yeah, there he is. What's that? Wasn't a very good idea for you, buddy. Oh, he's got anti-control. Ooh. Three of them took me out, though. That's for sure. All right. Help my team out over here. Here we go. That uh, Cerberus man he didn't uh, didn't really do too well, but you know, going against three, yeah, that's obviously a uh, tough one to uh, to do for any robot. But uh, yeah, it was uh, definitely pretty good. Get some uh, heals over here on this guy. And somebody's got a uh, kid that just deployed. This guy down. We go. Got our third beacon back at least, so that's good. Got him locked. 
put down. I am overheated though, so I need to uh, let these cool off. There we go. Save this spot just a little bit longer there. Does that one some? I'll give him some. I'll give him some. I'm gonna go down. All right, that's all right. We still have plenty of juice left uh, here. We'll go ahead and drop in the uh, leech now. These guys are gonna be in trouble for sure. over here. Double kill. That guy's way too far away. Should have somebody drop in at the farm over here. Maybe. I'm actually going to uh, leave the farm. I don't want to uh, Get that right now. I'm hoping somebody will uh, drop in over here. Nope. Oh, out of range. Too bad. Oh, my teammates get in the farm. I was actually going to leave it. Okay, buddy. Ooh, I couldn't resist going after that guy. Just couldn't resist it. Ah, oh, game ended. Ah. <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> I think that is going to uh, wrap it up uh, for the video, guys. Uh, take a quick look here. Uh, 2.8 million damage, 14 kills, 4 beacons. Um, overall, not too bad. A, a good job there on the uh, blue team for uh, for uh, getting the win out. And a, a pretty good job there on the red team for uh, trying to make us fight for it on those beacons. But, uh, okay, so that is going to do it. And uh, like I said, if you're interested in putting your name in the hat for the uh, Atomizer giveaway on this video, I will be selecting 50 people at random who uh, like, subscribe, and put a comment below that includes uh, hashtag atomizer along with their player ID and their platform. Uh, if you want more chances to win, keep an eye out for uh, the next video giveaway I will do later on in this month. Uh, also, make sure you drop by and subscribe to Islander's website. Uh, he is going to be doing his own atomizer giveaways this month. And then at the end of the month, he and I will get together and give out 100 atomizers on our podcast. Those podcasts go uh, on Sunday evening. Uh, if you guys can join us, that is great. But uh, anyway, don't forget to drop a like on the video, guys. Everybody stay safe. Chief out.